We created a survey asking the public for their input by filling into the blanks, filling into the blanks, um, and that survey was called, if I were SBC's president, I would, and that was just one of the things that he's done so far in his tenure. In his first few days at SBCC, Anthony Beebe is talking less about curriculum and more about building relationships with the community. One of the things that I believe strongly in is supporting community first when it comes to working with the community college. As former president of San Diego City College, he says one goal is enticing local high schoolers to stay home. SBCC student enrollment has steadily declined every year for the last six years, down 10 percent in the last year alone. More area high schoolers are not choosing their hometown college, while more international students are. We've capped the um, the international students that have been coming here. So, I mean, you know, there's different things like that, that that we're already being proactive about looking at in terms of scaling the college to fit the community. One initiative to bring students back, the college promise of free tuition to local high school students for two years. Challenges with higher housing costs and tuition remain. But BB says making SBCC bigger isn't the answer. I'm not um, necessarily looking to grow the college. Um, we need to find the scale of the college that's appropriate for the college, for the finances of the college, and for the community. Dr. Beebe says he's banking on the survey to help him understand the issues the community is worried about. A SBCC's trustee says he has the board's support. We talked to the students at San Diego City College and they all had only good things to say about him. And he's very community driven. So that's why I think already he's been out there. He's already been out there like five days being on the job, meeting people in Santa Barbara. So I think he's going to do an excellent job as president. The survey period ends on July 29th. So if you would like to voice out your opinion, you can go to our website to find that link. Santa Barbara, Vicky, News Channel 3. Okay, thank you, Vicky. Mark Melky.